Hi there, Lori Conrad here, and thanks for requesting this video on last night's training. Uh, last night's training was one of our Monday, uh, Mastery Mondays trainings. It's inside of Lifestyle Design Network. That's where um, we are a whole group of entrepreneurs that are learning how to um, Perf, you know, perfect our online marketing of our all of our products and services under the leadership of Mark Hoverson. He's right there in the picture on the left, and uh, Mark's been online for since 2006, 2007. He's made millions online. He's a master marketer, and Chris's picture right there in the middle. Um, the purpose of this training was to go over some of the concepts in his Instagram training. He has totally mastered Instagram. He's been getting buyers, leads, and making sales through Instagram from total strangers. And um, he's got really a very, very step-by-step, -step, easily understood process for learning how to do that. And that's what we've been talking about on Mastery Mondays for the last two Mondays. So that's the backstory. So that's what I'm going to share with you is, are some of my biggest takeaways from the last two Mondays, actually, not just last Monday. So this was my, um, my notes after I finished the training last night. I'd taken a whole bunch of notes, but basically this is my overview. All marketing is a series of clicks, and when you learn how to get people to from click to click to click to click to click, that is how you make money, that's how you gain authority, it's how you grow your audience, it's how you grow your following, and you build your email list, and it's all by clicks. So if you really focus on that, it's what online marketing is all about. So for example, if you, if you do an ad or even a Facebook post, the ad requires um, them to click and then it they go to the next step in the process right they'll either go to a capture page or they'll go to a video or they'll go to something that um, they're going to because they want some piece of value that you're offering them and we usually call that a lead magnet well we're now starting to call them honey pots and I'll get into why that is in a second then they usually go to another um, click where they'll enter their email then they go on your list then after they do that they're going to go to a thank you page where it's going to require another click maybe to another video maybe even to a seven dollar tripwire prod product but what you want to do is click 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 and click and in Chris's training in the Instagram training it's really specific how to get people to go from click to click to click with small pieces of investment on their part and um, bring people along so that they know, like, and trust you in a, in a really smooth, elegant, beautiful process. So the second important concept to understand is the definition of a honeypot. A honeypot is a free gift, it's oozing with value, and it requires some kind of attention or click to get it, okay? And if you are familiar with lead magnets, it's similar to a lead magnet, but it can be something so simple like what I did last night where I put this Facebook post out and I said I had went to this wonderful training I'm gonna shoot a seven minute video on it and I want if you want it just you know comment below send me the video that takes very little investment I didn't ask for anyone's email address I didn't make them click a link I'm gonna PM them the PM everyone the video so um, honeypots can be really really simple and then Mastery Monday number two was how to sell the next click and how to get all the way down five, six, seven levels deep into the clicks so that the, eventually the person will buy from you. So you're always offering something of value in exchange for every click and that's really the highest concept. So here's Mastery Monday from last week and it's about the miracle of the honeypot and how you can attract people with your honeypots. But the transaction scale is an important concept. Um, when somebody buys something, you know, that's our ultimate goal, right? We want to sell something, we want someone to purchase. Well, there's a trust barrier in between this and you, right? Because someone may not know you, they don't, they don't have any idea who you are or what your product is. So in order to get them to cross this trust barrier right here, there is a transaction scale. 
there's little mini transactions that get them over this barrier and over here and they are going to pay with their attention they're going to pay with their time say reading a post or watching a video they're going to pay with a comment that you ask them to do they're going to re they're going to pay with a reply to a, a private message they're going to pay with their email they'll pay to watch a video um, not really pay money to watch a video, but they'll pay with their time to watch a video um, and maybe even do the call to action that's under the video. So the more that you can create free honeypots that are going to get them through this transaction scale, the more successful you're going to be in getting them to purchase, cross over that trust barrier and get them to purchase because once the trust barrier is crossed you see all sorts of money so um, that was con big concept number one I wanted to share with you so to continue with honeypots just a little a honeypot is inviting people into the restaurant that's what I did with my Facebook post um, and let me just go over to the Facebook post really fast just to show people the post again so that they know what I'm talking about. I wrote a little letter, Dear Biz Friends, I spent 90 minutes on a training tonight, blah, 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 and between Mark's wisdom and Chris's wisdom and showing results that he's getting leads and he is making thousands of dollars in just a few months on Instagram, um, I have notes to share with you. I'm going to shoot a video. If you'd like to see it, just comment below, send me the video, and I'll make sure you get it. Okay, so that was my honeypot. And I'm going to go back to my... Here we go. Okay, so all you have to do is see an opportunity, spot value, and offer it to people in a honeypot and then you always want to have some kind of call to action like but a simple call to action you're always going to like avoid doing a Facebook post or an Instagram picture and a post and say you know go click this link and then it goes to a capture page what we want to do is is create clicks in between that process so that no like and trust is built before you get to asking them to take a big step. So um, uh, a honeypot could be as simple as my three favorite business books and why and what they've done for me. You know, it could be, um, it's just simply putting out um, value that people would like and um, small pieces of consumable value. All right, so Mastery Monday number two, and don't forget, both of these trainings were an hour to two hours, so I'm skipping over a ton, but I'm giving you the biggest takeaways. Um, Mastery Monday number two was about how to sell the next click. Um, so we know that a bunch of clicks creates a sale right so we went through what click number one is then we went through the secret to click number two we went through the secret to click number three and um, so the secret to click number one is just the honeypot retrieval giving them that honeypot and having a really good honeypot to give them um, and we talked about a lot of other stuff the secret to the second click okay is that once they get the honeypot you want to stay engaged with them and then you want to tell them what's coming how it's coming why it's important where it's coming to because a lot of times people will opt in to get a honeypot but then they actually won't take action on the honeypot you want them to take action on the honeypot so that they stay engaged and you want to show them visually everything that's going to happen with them so, um, okay, and then I think something was cut off, so I clicked this again. Okay, so now if you are going to lead them down the path to a longer video or a longer training, you don't want to just give it to them all at once. You want to actually give it to them with a third click. Show and tell what's coming next. Get them, keep them engaged, and show them actually getting the honeypot so they know exactly what's going to happen and they're not surprised, and you keep them not having to think about anything. So you're always going to sell that click before you give them a really long video or a big long consumable, you know, 20 page PDF or a long honeypot. 
And what a really important concept was anticipation. You want to keep the anticipation going so that they stay engaged. People love anticipation. It's like, oh, I'm going to get it. It's like when movies come out, you know, they talk about the movie. They have the trailer going for weeks before the movie comes out. It's the same concept. And, and Chris goes into the, into very, you know, Chris and Mark go into very intense, like, really step-by-step -step detail about all of this stuff in in the training pictures to profits um but what's important is getting those honeypots out there and all you need to do is repurpose content for honeypots you don't have to create new stuff you can take any wisdom that you already have from the trainings that you have available to you we have tons of them in ldn all of mark's trainings um now pictures to profits and um you can even get to the point where you go down click by click by click and then Chris actually has an application process that he brings people through um, to actually kind of qualify them to join him in his business and we go over why an application process is a good idea um, it helps keep them invested it helps keep them emotionally um, engaged in what you're doing and that they're connected to you they get to know you better you actually talk about what they're going to be involved in and it, it gets it every makes everything transparent and also um, establishes you as an authority you know in what you're doing and that's what the all these other clicks do too as you bring them down all these series of clicks you become a bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger authority in um, what you're teaching them and what you're helping them to do so um, after the end of last night's training Mark's Mark gave us all a challenge he said this is what you're gonna do you're gonna um, anybody who's game um, post a picture and uh, do a post on Facebook or Instagram or both um, create the video which is what I'm doing right now and then post the video inside the group inside of our LDN group so we can share with everybody and all learn from each other which is what we do in LDN so um, those are my biggest takeaways if you're interested in getting that training um, just just contact me you can email me or you'll you know you can just PM me on Facebook um, and I can show you how to get that training and if you'd like more trainings like this one you can always opt in with your email at lauriconrad.com because I give more trainings like this all the time so I hope that that was really valuable for you and I look forward to sending getting your comments on this and if you have any questions just PM me back um, or even put questions in the thread um, where I posted it on Facebook because if you have a question somebody else probably has the same question and we can have a conversation going there too so thank you so much I look forward to um, getting your feedback on honeypots and um, doing your clicks, and I will talk to you soon. Thanks for listening.